Yeah, we're, yeah, gonna, we're, we're back. back. We're going to have to uh, figure that one yeah, out. Yeah, that's going to be interesting. Maybe we can look at the settings. <sighs> yeah. So my computer just went into hide mode. Mm. I don't know how to stop it from going to sleep. Yeah, you got to wiggle the mouse. You just got to do this every once in a while. Okay. okay. Uh, yeah. I'll try and remember to do that. Mm -hmm. um, but there's also probably a sleep mode setting that I can turn off. Absolutely. At any rate, we don't want that on there either. No. Um, so she was like, well, I need to be there for that. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so she's like, I guess I'm coming on Friday. I don't have any laundry. And I can't do laundry because I only do laundry Monday, Tuesday. Yeah. My and I went. You remember your mom has a washer dryer? <laughs> you can bring your clothes dirty. She's like, oh yeah, I could do that. Yeah, I, could I didn't need to. I, I asked my I asked my landlord friend um, if I could jump in uh, and do some laundry. I said I'm gonna go down to my parents' house, and I forgot to do laundry this this past weekend. Can I jump in today or tomorrow? And he was like, yeah, today would work better than tomorrow. And I said I can do that. Sir. I can Thank do you. that. I can do that. So I did. A bunch of laundry. And I basically well, Andrew used to bring her to school. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, I would too because you know you have to haul. Yeah. So anyway, at the party yesterday, um, Chicken Sharon showed up. Oh my God! And if you all want to see what Chicken Sharon looks like, she is forever I in her so much. in our Instagram. Put her up on her Instagram. You can see her in in the reels there. And I'm just gonna Not pull it up reels, on my phone. Show you on right now. Yes, yeah, she'll pull it up for you. Um, she showed up. She's so adorable in a tutu. In mm -hmm. a handmade. She was a present. Yeah. She is the cutest human being I've ever met in my life. Mm -hmm. I love her. She's so. Cute. She's precious. She did, didn't she? She made that herself. Of course she did. DIY. I DIY really chicken turn. Um, yeah, from like the dollar yeah, store. Yeah, from the dollar store. She, she substituted she in for, for Deb on the tchotchke. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, yeah she for sure. sure did. She took yes. some tool sure. from Joanne's and mm -hmm. some some dollar store present Rose. toppers and, and, and went to town. And, and garland. Yeah, and garland and, and hot glue. And she had a class. Yeah. And her husband had to... Had to zhuzh it so that it was just right. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. He had to make sure that those bows were right in the yeah, right place. Strategically placed, placed yeah, yeah. so that they looked even. Oh my God, mm -hmm. too funny. So, and then she brought me this. Mm. It's really pretty. That's why I'm your alley. It's so hot pink. Hot. It doesn't quite do it justice on the camera. Mm -hmm. It looks more future y. It is so vibrantly hot pink. It is highlighter hot pink. It's amazing. With glitter from. Our favorite leading men, yeah. Fiber Arts. Um, is this is colorway Scarlet Sparkle Sock. Y'all, they have this in multiple different colors. It is fantastic. Very pretty. Um, we, Are you going to talk about... Yeah, I will. My orgasm. orgasm. My orgasm. Okay. So, because just who doesn't want to talk about their orgasm? Right. Oh. Um. Yeah, I'm on. I'm on the very last part of the third color. Right. Mm hmm So yeah, and this it's is gonna be really like pretty. Well, it's. It's been the only thing I've been working on. Oh, I like this. I like that. That's on. That's on. That's our, on the shop. It's <laughs> on our shop. Do I just go shop when I want? <laughs> yeah, she you shops. You shop from the warehouse. I, yeah, I do. <laughs> yeah. She goes to the warehouse. And I go shops to the warehouse. There. Mm -hmm. um, I do too. Every now and then when I'm here. So this is two gradient mini skein sets from Why Not Fibers in Michigan. Uh, Cat. Uh, the owner, purveyor, buyer, extraordinaire, mm -hmm. is absolutely she's hysterical, hysterical person. But this is a little sparkly as well, not as sparkly as this one. Y'all can see the sparkles in this one. Mm -hmm. You can't really see the sparkles on this one on the screen, but they're there. Trust me, it's there. It is. Um, wow. 
point out. But. Yeah. Um, I know I've showed this to you before, but it's colorway moss and I know I can't remember the other one either. Red. That's where I am on that. That's about all I have done, other than be sick. Yeah, well. And <laughs> work. And throw a party. Yeah, but that was fun yesterday. We all had a good time. It was. Holiday. It was a good time. And I had lots of new things. Um, I had lots of happy mail come in. I had lots of happy mail go out. I was no, go out. No, I have been busy. Um, but that's what you want. Which I appreciate. I'm immensely. here to help her reorganize because she's been busy. Been busy and, and, it's, and it looks kind of like a tornado went through. She says it's not that bad. Uh, well, when you're done with that, could you come organize my house? Because right now my house looks like a tornado went through it. I've I got, would love to. Uh -huh. <laughs> She's an that. organizer. I am an oh organizer. My, gosh. my oh. roommate Lizzie can know, and she 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 crafts and has more hobbies than anybody I've ever met in my life. She she she's amazing. She's amazing. She's a y'all hold up. I gotta go get you this quilt. Yeah, I gotta yeah. show you this quilt. Oh, yeah, this this quilt. Quilt. Yeah. But I all right. Everybody. While she's gone, I'm gonna tell you guys. I think Lizzie. Um, does hobbies like I do knitting projects. When oh. was the last time y'all saw me finish a knitting? So Lizzie's a quilter, painter, a beater. She's all the above. She does it all. She does it all. She does it all. Lizzie's rashes salon. She does wood carving. She does yeah sculpture. She does painting of every version you know that they, you possibly know they imagine. Can, you know, I know they can see you from there. I'm a small person. Look at this quilt. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's a king just, size quilt, you guys. It's king size, and it's beautiful. It's gorgeous. So pretty. Look at that. Yeah, that's work. That's oh. a great. It's a great backdrop. Just leave it up there. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah, we'll just we'll just her and I will just hold it up. <laughs> yeah. Just hold it there. The whole time. Right. No, no, I don't want to be the only one. Like, like uh, hey, my hair actually looks pretty decent today. Yeah, my hair's doing I don't know why. Yeah, I forgot to put my bonnet on last night. Same, so did I. So we've got we've got the frizz monster yeah, happening over here. All that we're you know we're related. Can you can you tell? I have I have half of my head shaved yeah she's, and i still have she's a mohawk girl i haven't quite gotten that, that she hasn't that. gotten mm -hmm. she hasn't she hasn't reached that level of desperation yet no if y'all know any wow I curl, got the curly hair that. cutters mm -hmm. in minneapolis mm -hmm. hit me up please for oh. the love of merlin <laughs> <laughs> i yeah. need some help <laughs> Yeah, Minneapolis, Minnesota. Sharon texted me name of a curly hair cutter here. Oh, okay, good. Good. Which Maybe I guess go I, need, see her. I need to contact oh, her. Look at that curly cute, curly cute. Yeah, yeah. that's pokey outy. It's a pokey outy. It's a pokey outy. Me, I used. All right, show Sorry. me. I want to see this reader's wrap. Damn it, bring it out. Yeah. She oh. is the finisher of this group. You know, she finishes projects. <gasps> Oh wow. my god, look at this. Guys. You guys, this gradient is beautiful. Wow. Oh my gosh, I love this. Holy that cow. Is so, so the edge what is, is so pretty. It's mainly our baby up. Wow. Hey, this is fantastic. This is beautiful. Stuff. That's a lot of pearling. I, I, I was yeah, going to say, know. I was going to say, I really want this but i don't want to pearl that much well it's only 80 stitches but it's still pearling it's 80 <laughs> stitches of pearl oh my gosh i don't know if i could wear it though well like I is said, it itchy it, it, it is so soft. so soft you guys what is the like what it what's the brand What's I don't know. I don't remember. Hold up, I gotta put it on the face. But Marsha was kind enough to order all kinds of kits for all of us. So um I've got another one in navy. 
that I'm things feel itchy I sometimes. Need, I'm gonna do. I'm I'm gonna hold. I'm gonna put this around. Okay, you go right. Leave this here for a little bit Just and see if that, that for a few minutes. bugs my neck. I might have to might have to do this. Yeah, this is so scrumptious. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's delightful. And you don't know what the freaking fiber is, what the brand I is. I don't know. I don't know. It's I don't. It's a bulky though, isn't it? It was all done on a size ten. So yeah. Oh, so that, probably. That edge is so pretty. Probably a bulky. Yeah, probably so. Is that the pearl you were talking about? I don't, I don't have. No, this... I don't know anything about anything. It's really... yeah. Yeah, no, she doesn't know anything about it. No, this is knit this way, so okay. it's knit, no. knit the short way. I don't have it. And um, it it's so just beautiful. The one row is knit, and then the next row is pearl, so that it looks like this. If you just knit knit, this is what it looks like. Yeah. Oh. This is knit pearl knit pearl. Interesting. Because it's pearl, pearl done this way. Yeah. Okay. Wait. What the layman's of the world think of a sweater? Yeah, is knit pearl. Is knit pearl knit pearl? Yeah. Yeah, I'm like, cause this, that's what this looks like. It looks like a. It, it looks, looks like, like a machine. It looks like a machine sweater. It looks it's like so a perfect. machine sweater. It's so perfect. <laughs> Far from that. And this hasn't been blocked yet. No. But it, to a layman's eyes. I can be like I can eyes. tell it hasn't been blocked because of the smell. Yeah. <laughs> You're right. It hasn't. No, it has the barnyardy sort of smell to it. It doesn't smell like detergent. Oh, or, it smells so good. Or nothing. It doesn't smell like nothing right. or like. Oh, it smells so good. But yeah, it has. I'm hoping it, it has, has that, an animal. It has, yeah, it has a natural smell to it. It has an animal scent to it. Alpaca. Oh, love it. 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 Oh, that's what it smells like. Oh, you're right. I am. Well. You didn't notice that. <laughs> <laughs> I was knitting on it the whole time and I never noticed the smell of it. Mm. No, it's not a bad smell. No, it's not. It's a really nice smell. I'm like, yeah. Okay. I'm like, well, just it just more. It smells nice. Dirty, no, it doesn't smell, smell dirty. dirty. It, just it, smells, smell. it just smells like, like, kind of like outside, I guess. Yeah. Oh, it smells like outside. Ender's favorite smell, outside smell. <laughs> you need to see if that I, I'll see if it's wrong now. Well, your neck's still not red, so. Yeah, no, I mean, I have, you know, a lot of hair. I don't know. Nope. Nope, nope you can't do it. No, I probably I can't do it. Can't do it. Probably couldn't do it. I, it's, it's, I just, my skin is, I apparently have sensitive skin. Everything feels itchy. It's itchy cashmere. You could probably do cashmere. I can do cashmere. I know cashmere doesn't feel itchy, but yeah, cashmere. there's something about <laughs> cashmere. 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 Right now, small. that's Marsha's favorite yarn that she's knitting. With. I know. Um, uh, Carly too. Yeah. Oh yeah. I think, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna veer away from the cashmere. Yeah. Are you? And go with the yak. Ooh. Because yay. I. That's okay. pretty soft too. Yeah, yeah, it is. But probably a little more difficult to find. Um, but yeah, if any of y'all know why why some some things feel itchy to other people but not to everybody, I don't know why. It's odd. It's it's just the fiber. I know, but it's like everybody else is like, oh, it's so soft. I'm like, it is soft, but it's also itchy. <laughs> yeah. yeah. See, I don't like mold. I don't know why it's itchy, but it's itchy. Yeah, I, I don't even like baby alpaca and stuff, you know. It's like there's oh, I love this, it's so soft. And I'm like, I can't have put you, it on my have face. You, have you wrapped um my original orgasm around you? Uh, I don't know. It's in my room, you should go get it wrapped okay. around you. That's baby alpaca. Yeah. I'm gonna refill my cocoa water. Um yeah. <laughs> um oh, Tori. What? So we did a white elephant exchange. Mm -hmm. Um, yesterday, and I think some people really embrace the whole white elephant. <laughs> when we do a white elephant, I tell people that they're not allowed to spend any money. Right. It has to be something within your house that you no longer need, want, or desire, and it cannot be knitting related. Right. Because we also do yarn exchange. That right. too. So, um, there were some really good ones. The, we got a bicycle which there was were, absolutely i mean horrible. like a small miniature yeah. bicycle not one that you it would actually cool. um beat it and whatnot so i think cute. she got it from where did she say in india. india 
India. India. Yeah. It was made in India. She's like, I still, it had the tags on it. She probably got it as a white elephant gift too. Yeah, she said she did. Um, I, I gave, uh, King Charles Cavalier plates. Five of them. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. my God. You did. <sighs> oh, um, but they were so cute. They are cute. So, yeah, but right. She's also had them for twenty years. Oh well. <laughs> and they've always been in a drawer, and I just didn't want to get rid of them because, you know, heaven forbid, the person that gives them to you wants to know who's got. Um, Some. I did. I did. I didn't, didn't get, rid get rid of the sandals because, of course, I got a full set, like twenty-four, whatever. Right? Yeah. Um. Yeah, she has a lot of them. There was a coffee cup. I got a lamp shade. Oh yeah, that's. I was like, what? Got a lampshade. It's a it's really cute. Candle. It's a candle shade, but it's a lampshade candle shade. Yeah. yeah. Um. To so put on top of like a a Yankee candle. A Yankee candle. Um. What else? What did you get? What was your white elephant gift? Oh, you got the salt I got, and pepper. I got she got salt. cheap cheap salt and, and pepper a, and, and, a and a candle. And a that's candle. Not a white that's elephant. not white elephant. That's cute. That's a gift, and it was yeah. fucking knitting related because it was cheap yeah. salt and pepper things. Who did that? Who did that? They're naughty. They didn't pay. Oh, it was probably Sharon because she didn't she follow, didn't follow the, the rules, rules for the yarn either. Oh. No. no. Oh, wait, yeah. yeah it she been. did not follow the rules for, for the yarn. For some reason, my brain went to the bike. Our rules for the yarn was one skein of sock yarn. Uh, yeah. It, with no mohair. <laughs> what does Sharon do? Two skeins of Worst wor No, no. Sport. Oh, okay. And a skein of a sock. So she did three skeins. I guess she wanted to get rid of it. <laughs> I don't. Know. But she also won. I, we gave, um, there was a, a surprise little gift for the person who wrapped the skein of yarn. The prettiest. The prettiest. Was, which was, you know, my rules, whatever. Um, and she put hers into a Diet Coke box. <laughs> it and was great. Before it what, was hilarious. It was awesome. So all of them are on the table, and I'm like, okay, we need to vote. And Colleen, I think Colleen said, well, I'm going for I'm the, going Diet for the Diet Coke, Coke box. Yeah. It's funny. Brilliant. And I'm like, everybody consensus. I it. second that because, you know, whatever. <laughs> yeah. But of course it was hers because she had three skeins of yarn inside mm -hmm. of a freaking Diet Coke box. Um, so, and her prize was Miss Deborah, who's still on a cruise ship now. Yep. Um, earlier, before she left, she brought over a shopping bag full of yarn that had been wrapped up. 17 yep. skeins. 17 skeins of yarn that she had, you know, gone through some box of hers and thought, oh, these would be great to give away to the girls. So, um, she wrapped them all. And said, here's to give these out at the party. And I'm like, okay. So because there were 17, there was eight of us here. Mm -hmm. Everybody got two, except mm -hmm. for the person who won. Got three. Got three. And I made her pass them out. Yeah. Because what a better gift than that. Yeah, mm -hmm. really. So. And, and it was, was unexpected. Fun. Right. Yeah. Yes. So, so Deborah. Thank you, Debbie. Thanks for dispatching. Um, but you just built up the rest of your friends and stashes even more. <laughs> okay, but I mean, it's a pretty, it's a small distribution. Yeah. You know, right. Not giving and, each friend. And I think games. she has, I think she has stopped her moratorium. So she, well, I'm sure she probably has. I mean, she's on vacation. So, I mean, well, I think she, I think she continues to book her vacation so that she can have an excuse to buy yarn oh, well. because she set that stipulation on herself. She can buy yarn if she's on vacation. So she just <laughs> continually <laughs> goes on vacation. <laughs> on vacation. <laughs> so, she, so she can buy yarn. God damn, I, Jeb, you beautiful, beautiful girl. I love oh, you. Yeah, she's she did, great. She did do that stipulation for it's herself. So, so, so she's, um, she's a good person. There's that. And funny to boot. Right? There's that. There's that. All right, you're working. You're still working on that puzzle, Kirk. Yes, but, 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 but she, look, it's she, getting smaller. She, she finishes projects in between. Unlike me, I just start another project and never finish. This is carnival from leading men. Order fourteen skeins of it because they hate making it. Yeah, they this do, is the one color way that. 
anything, but they can take it off because they can discontinue anything. Um, so let them know that the flock sent you when you want to yeah. go get that one. And Ander can't figure out how it works. Really, Carnival so. from Leading Men. So you're getting there. She just shakes her head. And their showstopper line. Yes. 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 Carnival. I don't really have a whole lot more else going on. Mm -mm. That's not the right one. Oh, no. Oh, no. You got the wrong one. I'm sorry. You got on Pendy Arrow, and that I know you like because that is um, from. Who is the yarn? Wine back. It's got cashmere in it. Yeah, it's not bad. Yeah, it's. It's got like a tiny little bit of itch to it, but not. Not enough to be bothersome at all. Right. Or it's like, um, that other one was. I'm trying to think of the fiber. I'm trying to think of the fiber. Yeah. Mm. Okay, so it's been a while since you guys have seen this one. Yeah. Miss this it's one. It's very pretty. I just went into the arm room and I went, which one is orgasm? And then I said, I think it's this one. And I put it on. And I was wrong, apparently. Bendy yeah. Arrow is. This is Bendy Arrow. Yeah. Name makes sense. It's uh, cool. And I'm, I'm, I'm brain farting the uh, fiber. It's not like it's, men, is it? No, no, it's not. No, 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 no. It's not ball. No. Uh, Wool and honey carries it. Oh, uh, well. Up it's in Michigan. Really good, okay. It's a good swoosh. It's got good swoosh. This is, so I did my Rhinebeck hat um, in these colors. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, in the hat called Cardamom, which is a colorway mm -hmm. hat. I think it's a pay for pattern on Ravelry. Um, but it's called cardamom, like the spell. And it's a fun little um, color work hat. Can we go grab it? It's up in the laundry room. Oh, no. no, no. You probably can't reach no, it. I can't reach it. Um, <laughs> <laughs> no, you probably can. It's on the bottom shelf. Above the dryer, if you want to. Just I would have to climb onto the dryer. Um, so a bunch of us went and instead of doing sweaters, because some of us can't finish a sweater in a timely fashion, we decided to do hats and we all did the cardamom mm -hmm. hat. And so I made you one too. I, saw I made two. She did. Yeah. She made two. She but made one. I found out that I had to make the hat when I was up in Michigan to see uh, the grocery Mia. girls, mm. the grocery girls, which is oh. another podcast people's yeah they um and wool and honey was sponsoring the event and doing the thing so of course this dyer that i can't think of was there as well i'm mm -hmm. a brain fart so brain of fart. course i had to pick them up and these five years ago or whatever mm -hmm. um it's been a while they were like 38 dollars a stain oh so for my hat <laughs> Yeah, your hat. My hat was over a hundred dollars. No, it's too bad. It's too bad they can't see the expression on her face. Yeah, uh, no, we have we have an audience on the other side here. Yeah. I was like, um, that's steep. That's steep for a hat, Jiminy Christmas. And I don't and the even lime, do that. And the, this is a lime green, or it's like a, it's like a. Olive. Acid green. Yeah, it's like an acidy olive. I don't know. So there's just this one little part of the pattern that has a pop of color. Um, the rest of it is kind of traditional color work, sort of. But they put this pop of color. So really, it only had like 10 stitches. <laughs> this <laughs> and, you know, these are my colors. This is like, you yeah, know, topi pink. brown gray. And pink. soft pink, pink, totally me. And then I had to put this pop of color in, and I first had highlighter yellow because I thought that would have been interesting. Um, but one with the green, whatever. We don't look good in yellow. But it's just that little bit right in the middle. And we look good in yellow. What are you doing? Andrew's Although, Andrew's if we're gonna wear a yellow, yellow, it has to be highlighter yellow. Also, I mean, what yarn did you get? yesterday in the exchange when we had the oh she got the uh the sparkly purple pink thing didn't you no that was oh. from deb what did i get oh. you show yours i'm gonna go look like, okay. i do not know what you got i forget 
Okay. 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 Um, this was my exchange. This is from the Wool Baron. It's sock yarn. Sorry. It's got Christmas colors in it. Thank you, Colleen. So pretty. I know because she she likes the Wool Baron. Okay. So, but I actually stole it from Jane you did. Sharon. So I opened. <laughs> I, so I opened. I open like six of these things because yeah, people because obviously I don't I don't knit I don't you know it's fine but I was I was filling in for Carly Carly for Carly I was I, I was Carly yeah because Carly wasn't there so it was my turn to open and then Chicken Sharon stole because I opened those and yeah. Chicken Sharon was like oh I like that so she stole them and then she stole them from Chicken Sharon and then her mom's rules and they were dead you can't steal them again that was three. And freeze the limit. And Sandy tried. Sandy tried. She Mom tried. was like, hey, hey. <laughs> those are dead. So, they cannot keep moving. <laughs> and then the skeins that were given to us from Deb. Mm -hmm. This is the McMillan Fiber Company. It is 80% superwash merino, 10% cashmere, 10% nylon. And it is so, so, so nice. I love it. Oh. Favorite. It's got purple in it. Yeah. Purple yeah. and mustard and, and, yeah. and, and then beautiful. Of Ooh. course, my color blue. Guys, so. I am like completely trying to blank. I do not. I, know. I can't remember. I don't even remember what I opened up. Oh. So Marcia got these from Deb, and Marcia said she wouldn't use them, mm -hmm. and if I wanted them, and I said, "Well, I'll put them in my pink blanket." Yeah. So. Yes. This one I got from Chicken Sharon mm -hmm. as a hostess gift. Mm -hmm. And yeah. these two were from Deb. 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 And I know I got another one from Deb because that came in one packet. That was a world as one. Right. Two. I don't know because I, Sharon handed them out. So she I said, I don't I was know last. what I did for the, for the, for the, I don't know what I got. I don't even remember what I got for the yarn exchange. The, the dark purple. Oh, the oh, dark, yeah, yeah, dark yeah, purple. Yeah. Oh, and I threw it in. Yes. It's my favorite it's in, color. It's in, it's in my, um. Yeah, I'll go grab it. No, yeah. I threw it, I threw it in, in my and blanket your, bag. Your, your big brown bag. Red, oh. red bag. Red one. Right, the pink, okay. but it's the pink blanket bag. Yeah. Yeah. It's the, it's the bag for the pink I blanket. said, oh, there's pink in it because we, y'all, this is my favorite color purple. <laughs> I'm so jealous, <laughs> but it is super it's dark. So pretty. pretty. It's very so super pretty. dark. It matches my nails. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, on screen, it is actually showing up a lot lighter it than yeah, what, it is. It's, what it truly is. Yeah. And so I was like, I don't know if I could knit on this and still be able to see mm -hmm. at the end of the day. Um, yeah. so I decided that it probably is going to work its way into my pink blanket. It's not pink in it. Because there is pink in That'll be pretty. It's got the stripes of pink. Oh, that has it's a smear in it. It's good. And silk. Oh. And so as silk. Nice. But still it's sock based, you know. Um, yeah, I yeah. forgot all about that. I stole that. You did. You stole it. I stole that from you. Mm-hmm. I stole it from Carly. Yeah, you stole it you from stole Carly. It. I was I like, stole it from Carly. Carly, I'm sorry, but I stole some cashmere from well, you. Well, wasn't this from Carly? I don't know. I, I think we determined it was from Carly. I don't know. But I stole it because I was like, I have to have that. Which is really pretty. Thanks for reminding me what I've forgotten. Yep. I got you. <laughs> well, you've slept since then. And I think, I think the other one that I got from Deb, I gave to Colleen. Because I yeah. said, here, you make socks with this. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think. No, that sounds right. I think I remember that. I was like, well, I, I, you I, guys were up here on the floor. I was on the couch, so yeah. I didn't get to hear everything. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a floor sitter. So, um, yeah, that's been our couple of weeks, and I hope you guys have had a good couple of weeks. You have to, did you show? I did yeah. show that. You showed this one. Did you yeah. show that one too mm -hmm. while I was gone? Uh -huh. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. yeah. You were good kids. I, 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 I got nothing else and I got nothing else. Nothing else? <laughs> I got 
Not, not, not uh, she's still asleep not, because not, she got up later today, so she's still asleep. And she woke up really late at seven. Yeah, that's amazing. I slept until nine. ten to nine. I woke her up at ten to nine. It was like a zombie. I'm like, they're gonna show up in like ten minutes. You might want to pee and have a cup of coffee before they and show I up. Did. I I really I true I I was not a human being for at least the first thirty minutes. Well, nobody is. I, sometimes I'm good. Sometimes no. I'm not. Don't talk to me. Don't look at me. <laughs> oh, that's my me, roommates. Just let me. Do that's my absolutely thing. my roommates. Yes. Like if, if I see them awake for the first hour, no, don't I don't function them. before noon. Yeah, that checks out. I cease to function at noon. <laughs> She's been up for six hours by well, noon, or longer, or eight, or ten, or ten. Yeah. This woman, like, at waking noon, up like, for the morning in the middle of the night. Yeah. Yeah. This last week, y'all, it has been between two and four o'clock in the morning that I've been waking up. Mm-hmm. At two or four o'clock mm-hmm. in the middle of the night. I'm like, so when I've been waking up for the day, mm-hmm. and then at, you know, seven thirty, eight o'clock at night, I'm like, and I haven't napped. So I'm, I'm just like, you know, I'm tired. I'm going to go to bed. And then I go in bed and watch something for an hour before I fall asleep. And mm-hmm. I fall asleep and I wake up at two. Yeah. And really? I'm just awake. So with me here, hopefully I'm able to force her to stay up a little later and then she sleeps like a normal person That's it, during the nighttime. No, because when we were in Michigan, <laughs> she... I slept fine. She slept fine. Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, the I, door was open. I was still wake up until I went up like five. That's still late for me. Yeah, yeah. five is still late. For- but you got to sleep in the cool. I did get to sleep in the cool. She I got, got to, to sleep, sleep in, in a cold in a in a blanket burrito. Yeah. Yeah, but this was cold. This was this was, was this, cold. Was this May camping cold? No. No. Okay. No. no. We used to camp in at May. In, in May. May in Minnesota. Yeah, in Minnesota. We used to go camping in May. In we Minnesota. did that on purpose though because we didn't we didn't want bugs no. and we didn't want hot. And we didn't want people. <laughs> we wanted to be away from the people and the bugs. And yeah. So you go camping else. the week before Labor Day. Yeah. Is Labor Day Memorial, Memorial Day. Day. Yeah, with the main ones. Yeah. The, the, the week Day. before, we would always do mm-hmm. an unplugged week. Yeah. In a campsite. The, my campsite's a Holiday Inn. That's my husband's first. Okay. Yeah, I too. Okay. Ours, I ours involves wood, fire. <laughs> So much wood fire. Sleeping bags. Lots of leading mm-hmm. and coffee. No phones, no internet. No phone, no internet. Yeah. Remember the first year we went? That a tornado actually went over the campsite that we were at. Mm-hmm. We didn't know about it. Because no we didn't have internet, phones, whatever. No clue. And the we were in a state park yeah. campsite. So if there was <laughs> eminent like danger, the they would have told done the si- sirens and whatnot. Yeah, we were. Um, okay, but but we all, of course, all of our family knew where we were, and we were they're getting concerned. all of Obviously. this information uh, that a tornado is actually going right over where we right, were, literally right over us. Uh, but no. we were down at a valley, and it just kind of skipped over the valley. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, everybody was like freaking out. Like, yeah, where are they? Are they okay? Yeah. Has anybody been able to contact them? No, because no, we because were them. in the valley. Mm-hmm. That had we no had service. That. We, we had didn't no have internet. internet. We didn't have cell. Yeah. And then we had to drive into town that was like a half an hour away just to get cell service. Mm-hmm. So we'd go in, we we'd get coffee, we'd get a mocha we'd at the, a mocha. At the, well, this is after we drink a piece of hot coffee. Oh yeah. Campfire coffee. Vicky, I thought I heard somebody knock. Of course. Well, I, I hope don't... she would be ringing the doorbell. Yeah. I don't ring doorbells. Well, whatever. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah, whatever. So, but that was when we met the Blue, Blue Hilton, Hilton Boys. boys. <laughs> the Blue Hilton Boys. Oh, they were, I love them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They <laughs> were um, gentlemen that would camp the same week every mm-hmm. year. Every year. They were from all over the country, and they would come to this campsite, um, and they constructed a cabin out of PVC pipe and blue and tarp. Blue tarp. Oh, they my had a coal God. burning. It was it was amazing. They, yeah, they had a coal burning had fireplace coal inside burning, of it, like fireplace inside that they brought with them with a flue and everything. Mm-hmm. They, they brought, had a whole decked out uh, situation. They brought wood 
wood um wood flooring flooring mm -hmm. and carpeting mm -hmm. so that when they were camping they had carpets <laughs> mm -hmm. they had bunk bed um mm -hmm. cots it was amazing. so they slept like eight or ten guys yeah. inside of this blue hilton tent on a regular camp hilton. on a regular camping site um and they brought us a jug of of uh bloody mary's well, that they were nice. so sweet. They were great. They were like, they were just, they were grandpas. Yeah, right? I was just a bunch oh, of old grandpas. Like somewhere between 50 and 80. Yeah. Right? <laughs> just so they were in that range. That old man. It was so sweet. They I were great. Them. And so we asked them if they did that every year at the same yeah. time. Yes. And yes. we always do Same, same, same lot, same, same lot. campsite, same So lot. the next year, we, we, we went, went to the exact same place. Yeah. So we got funny. the same lot right? yeah. next to the Blue Hilton Boys. Next to Blue Hilton Boys. We, be, it, we yeah. became a, a tradition for a handful of years. They had to bring in <laughs> all of their stuff in two trucks. Mm -hmm. To oh, construct. Yeah. Two big trucks. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they we were... fit everything that we brought in the Civic and in or the Civic. Fit. Yeah. No, you never. Yeah, I bought, I bought the Fit once or twice. Because I had to meet you. But that wasn't when we went down south. That yeah, was no, that no. was just local. That was local. That was when we, when we did local. Yeah, that was whatever. I so, but yeah, so her and I primitive camped a lot. Yeah, and the week the week before Memorial Day, it gets cold at night it does in Minnesota cold. in May. In May, it's yeah. cold, hmm. but no bugs. Sometimes <laughs> Mille Lacs is still frozen yeah, over in on Mother's Day. Mm -hmm. So, oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah you know, it, it gets cold. The first year that we did it, we had to go. We had to go into we, Rochester. Yeah, to get, to go to a, like a, a Goodwill to get extra like wool blankets. Yeah. Yeah. To, to line the bottom yeah. of the air mattress. The first night we didn't realize oh we were so cold we were so cold we literally emptied out our entire suitcases and had everything on top mm -hmm. all of our clothing under that we brought, and on under top of us on top of because us because the cold is seeping through the, the air was, the, the air in the in the air mattress there was no insulation so yeah we, we figured out really quickly how to make it so that we weren't cold that night yeah yeah mm -mm. yeah and then it was easy from that point. and then it was once we, once we was figured good. it out yeah we're good. We're good with cuddling. So yeah, we're totally know. good with cuddling. Body warm, but it's it also pretty good. funny. Yeah, <laughs> it was pretty funny. Yeah. No, that's good just stuff, good stuff. way too primitive for me. <laughs> we're both kind of pyros. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we're totally good with. Mm. Yeah. Oh my god, the raccoons! Yes. Did Did you ever know that the raccoons that got in the tent every single night? Do yeah. you know that he was in every single night? I didn't. I don't know if I knew that it was every night. Oh, they came in every night. I knew about it, but you didn't. They would have freaked raccoons. out. They would unzip our, we had a double walled tent. So the screen, they would unzip. And then the, um, um, the other. And then the mesh. The screen, yeah, the. The regular tent part and then the screen part, they would unzip just enough to get into the tent, walk around, see if they can find anything that they could munch on, and, and then, then leave. leave. Um, the first night, I actually woke up and caught him chewing on the corner of a Cheez-Its box. Because <laughs> we, they had garbage cans for, and the recycled things for that sort of stuff. Yeah. But if it was cardboard, like like the cheese it's box just cardboard we would save it to start to start the fires the yeah. next day so the plastic insert had gone into the recycle but the box we saved for you know fire starter and i threw it into the tent after that we realized that anything anything could, anything that could come smell like food chapstick yeah um Anything and everything had to go into the car. It had to be in yeah. the car because we, we, we also, tried with we tried with the picnic table. They, they, so they we come. duct taped. This is absurd, you guys. We well, so they broke into our our cooler uh -huh. and stole our food. Right. The Blue Hilton boys said, "Well, you really need to lock it. Lock it. It needs to have like a padlock on it." A padlock. Well, we didn't have a padlock, but I had duct tape. For so, the raccoons. So we duct taped it in several different ways. Round multiple directions. Multiple directions. You guys. And then we put a picnic table on top of it. We set the picnic table on top of the cooler. We lifted the picnic table up. They got into it. And put it on top of the cooler. 
they got into it again the next night. So oh we God. had to go back into town and <laughs> buy more stuff. And of course, they don't buy. They don't take the. They don't take the crap. No, they take the good the bread. bread. Well, yeah. And the eggs and the bacon. Yeah, they take the, the good bacon. Bread. They took oh, the they bacon took and the good bread. They left the shit bread, but they took the good bread. <laughs> yeah. Take the good bread. Fucking <laughs> raccoons. They take the eggs. They take the butter. Take the butter. They love the shit. They, and they love the trash. <laughs> I call them ninja. I call them ninjas because they truly are ninjas. I, swear to God, I don't understand how they got through that. Yeah, under, I don't. And move to the picnic. How do raccoons move a picnic table? They're pretty smart. <laughs> they have thumbs. Yeah. You're right. Little suckers. <laughs> so from then on, we. It, 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 it cooler just stayed, stayed in, in, the, the car, in the in the in the in the trunk. Yeah, the cooler inside stayed the in the trunk. My neighbor across the street, mm-hmm. she feeds <gasps> the raccoons. No! Stop we it. They're trash pandas. We won't tell you what the other neighbor does. Yeah. We have a war with the squirrels in my in my house because we have an apple tree. Oh. They love in apples. the middle of, of South Minneapolis, we have an apple tree. And these fucking ra- these not the raccoons, the squirrels, they eat. Everything. Oh yeah. Well, it's delicious. They're as bad as the raccoons. It's absurd, and there's thousands of them. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, we do. Have we have them all over the yard. Yeah, fuck it. Well, you could you could feed him. But he's he he eats the scraps that are left by the squirrels. <laughs> sure, oh. he's fine. He's fine. He's fine. <laughs> yeah. I think we should probably wrap this guy up yeah, here. Probably. Everybody have a Merry Christmas. Yes, we will not be here next Sunday. So um, I will be on your way home. On my way home or in Tennessee. <laughs> Going to my in-laws. <laughs> so, and you guys are having Christmas at your house? Uh, Christmas Eve and then we go to my sister's house for Christmas because it's her son's birthday. Oh. oh yeah <laughs> so yeah. yeah okay you know my brother's birthday is the day after i understand how yeah. Wade, billy billy wait Hall- wait's a halloween baby mm. billy's the christmas baby and you're the spring baby yeah i'm the easter baby yeah yeah <laughs> yeah there you and go. i'm the late christmas present birthday present yeah yeah ah. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right, you guys have a great Merry, 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 Merry Christmas and all that Bye. jazz. See you next time. Bye. Bye. No, no, really, I did not know we were not. <laughs> she 